Hi, I'm Ryan from National, and I'm here to show our SDI clocking solutions, which include the LMH 1981 and the LMH 1982. Our setup includes an analog signal generator, a Xilinx FPGA demo board, which includes our clock module, and a waveform monitor. The signal path here is the analog signal generator will send out um, a 1080i 59 signal which goes into our clock module right here. The LMH 1981 is a sync separator that strips out the timing to be able to pass to our next chip, the LMH 1982. It's able to strip out with 50% sync slicing which result in low jitter even if the signal is attenuated. The LMH 1982 will take those extracted timing and generate one HD and one SD clock at multiple rates. Typically, this would require four VCXOs right here. However, our solution only requires just one, which reduces your PCB area and the number of VCXOs. The timing that this chip generates based off our reference is sent to the FPGA. The FPGA has firmware which we include and it, control, it also controls our clock generation chip. This firmware will generate a SDI video signal as a test pattern. The test pattern can be seen here to the right on our waveform monitor. And we can also analyze the jitter on this, which shows our jitter meets the timing specs of below 0.2 UI, which is the SMPTE specs for this. For more information on uh, our clock generation solutions, please visit national.com/sdi. Thanks for watching.